I am going to tell you that I know the guys from State House that went and entered that agreement with Milungulungu. I know how much they, ha they have received. I know how much HH has received. This, that's why when you are... Watch the entire video, my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. And when people talk, no, how about PF? Eddie Galungu say I can also I can also commission I can also commission a, a toilet. <laughs> PF is the measuring uh, ruler now for UPN. So every nonsense that PF did, you must do it. Why did we remove them from power now? Why? What is the why did we remove them if you must compare? The reason why PF was removed is because they failed in one way or the other. So from their failure, when someone says ah, a, pre a whole president commissioned a toilet, PF did it. Where you voted because PF did it. <laughs> eh? So this is because the HH is a good guy, but he has surrounded himself with fools. Fools that don't know nothing. Fools that will die in jail fools that where are those guys that surrounded the digalung those guys that surrounded the digalung i mean father frank walia eh where are they where is frank walia today is he not with hh the same parasite have left where they were eating before they have joined upn and they are busy destroying upn a whole president, not even a district commissioner will commission a toilet. A whole president went and commissioned a toilet. And when people talk, ah, but PF did it. I was even reading on, uh, on uh, ZNBC today. They are talking about inflation in Nigeria. So that people will come and say, ah, but see, one, your country is this, your country is that. But you are not talking about your country, you talk about Zambia. A whole national broadcaster. Hmm? Here in uh, here in Nigeria, there, they don't not they don't even know what is, uh, ZNBC is. They they don't know that there is a country is it, uh, NTA Nigeria National Television Authority don't know that there is a country called Zambia. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that is also to show you how powerful i am how influential i am there all those things you write about nigeria you write it because of me a whole national broadcaster has become a disaster a playground so if i decide to attack a church if i decide to fight a church who is going to wage the war who is capable of waging the war at least for PF, those guys who were so, so sophisticated, Smart Eagle was so sophisticated. Uh, 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 there were too many. Even uh, Mwebantu was with them. They were so sophisticated, they could counter things that I say. So if I decide now, and say, okay, we are all out for HH. Who is going to fight back? When I when I come out with an exposure, you post that. Uh, uh, how about Nigeria? <laughs> you were not elected to compare yourself to Nigeria. You were elected to change the life of the people. It was very wrong 
for a whole president to commission toilet, even if it was one million toilets. You compare yourself to Nigeria. I mean, you Nigeria. By the way, Nigeria is suffering. Have you been to Nigeria, please? <laughs> Nigeria, Nigeria do projects of uh, Nigeria do projects of billions of dollars, not millions. Just here in Imo State, my state, our GDP is bigger than the entire GDP of of uh, of, of Zambia. And you are comparing. I we don't compare these things. I, that's why you don't see me compare these things. All of us loved her church and wanted uh, we wanted him to succeed. Personally, to me, I had an agenda of at least 50 years of UPN because I know that any day that HH leaves office, that guy. That guy, that guy is finished. I know. Any day he leaves office, whether in 2026, 20, 2030, 20, 2030, 20, that will be the last day he will experience life. I know. And I didn't want that to happen to him. I don't want that to happen to him. My project for UPND was 50 years project. So that by the time that uh, UPND would have left power, HH would have been in his 90s working with a walking stick. What will you do to a man that is working with a walking stick? <laughs> but because of his, the people that are advising him, the people that surround him, he's shortening his stay. He will be fought. I will fight him and I will defeat him. It's not even a, it's not even a, a, it's not even a, me and you can argue here. The few press singer that are remaining, we can argue here. But when the time comes, you will dance the dance that PF we are dancing. And the reason why I want him defeated. It's not just because of him. He has surrounded himself with criminals, with thieves, with looters. A few days ago, we had a, a news that uh, Milungolungu has agreed to forfeit 24 million US dollars. And uh, because of that, you will not go to jail. And many of you are clapping. You don't know the details of those deals. I am going to tell you that I know the guys from State House that went and entered that agreement with Milingulungu. I know how much they, ha they have received. I know how much HH has received. This, that's why when you are playing with the devil, Give to Caesar what belongs to Caesar and give to God what belongs to God. Then you will live long. But if you think that you are clever, you won't live long. If I come here and share, to, and share with the nation exactly what happened, the people that went and sat with Milingolungu, how much they received from State House, Many of the, that's why Eddie Galungu was a very clean man until I came and started telling people, okay, check here and check here. That's what you are going to do to HH. There is a lot of dirty thing that is going on. Dirty, the day I will come and say it has started, <laughs> that's not why I came here. Time for that is coming. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.